You can mention it my name. We don't like what you say. I don't give a fuck. Y'all can suck my dick. In this video, I want to talk about how we can check to make sure our listing is indexing for all of our main keywords and even our long tail keywords which are a little bit less search volume but still important. Now I have a, a large keyword list here that relates to our specific product which is these meal prep containers. Why is it important first off to make sure that we're indexing? Now what indexing means is that when you search any one of these search terms that our actual listing shows up somewhere in the search results. I don't care if it's on page one to page 100. We just want to make sure that it's actually showing up. Because if it doesn't show up, then there's no possible way that we can rank for that keyword. And it's one less keyword that we can get a sale for. So the way we go about checking to see if our listing is indexing for all our keywords is by using a simple free tool. But now I want to show you first off of what this keyword tool does and how it makes our life so much easier. So typically the way that you would find out if you're indexing for your keywords is you would copy the ASIN. Here we go. You would put it in the search field after your search term or your keyword and then you press search and look it shows up and you would go down the list. See if food storage container shows up we have our ASIN next to it searches and there it is still but now if we put in something like basketball zero results but if this was one of our good keywords we would want to find a way to make sure that we index for that keyword and the way you would do that is by potentially adding that keyword to your bullets somewhere in your back end or to your title and make that adjustment and eventually over time you will start indexing for that keyword but now what's a quick and easy way to do this well, that is what I have here, this uh, market hustle tool, which I'll have um, in the description. So what you do is you take your ASIN, you paste it here, then you take all your keywords, right? Instead of having to do one by one, we take all of them, copy, and we paste them. Remember, it says here, enter keywords, phrases on separate lines. So now we have all of them, and then we just click analyze. And we will see here. Whenever you see one that says false, that means our product is not indexing for it. And then it's up to us to think to ourselves, okay, do I want to be showing for this search term or keyword? And if we do want to be showing for it and it comes up here false, we need to find a good way to add it to our listing, whether it's in our bullets, whether it's in our back end, whether it's in our description, and whether it's in our title. Then what we would do is wait a few hours and then run this tool again and see if the false turns into a true. So we see with this listing, it's already coming up for quite a bit of false, which means there is still room for improvement. If we look at this listing though, this listing is a total animal. If we were to run Jungle Scout on this, it would say it's getting tens of thousands of dollars in sales per month. Because we look at the BSR, the best seller rating, and it is 95 in all of Home and Kitchen. That's incredible. But there is still room to optimize this listing. Because we can see here, bento box lunch, bento boxes for adults, disposable lunch containers with lids, all of these meal planning containers, all of these keywords, this listing is not showing up for. So that is a little quick tool that you can check out each one of your listings to make sure it's fully optimized and that all your keywords are indexing.